boop, and a boop, and a boop. Go! Sure, let's put on a scope. It doesn't really matter much. Have some of this stuff. No, oh, don't want to get rid of that. Wait, I have a mod for this thing? Oh, sweet. Um, been a basic bitch armadillo. Increase my armor a little bit more. Most of the armor coming from these pants are because of this. So if we could only find some more with some actual slots in it, that'd be nice. Uh, we need to craft some armor, I'm pretty sure. I can craft crepe armadillo, okay. <laughs> Never have enough ammo for this bloody thing. Cool. Anything else? Alright, it's coming. I got stuff stashed here. What do you got? Have a system. Makes you immune to burns, that'd be nice. Need body eight. Ugh. Can I sell, sell old implants or anything? I don't think so, can I? No. Mmm, cyberware mod, okay. Armor by 7%. Get that. River. B. Hey. I need your help. Hello? I cannot hear you. What up? Sounds like it. What happened? Talk about this on the hollow. We gotta meet. When and where? where Tell you? me. Glenn, tonight. I'll flick you the details. Will you make it? Uh, I'll Do try. Thanks, V. Didn't even know realize I didn't realize he called me. No, not that one. I wanted... Nope. No. Cyberware. Damn. You can change the type of knuckles you have. Hmm. Guess you need a different one to get that uh, armor one that is pulled, but then, whatever, it's only 900.
Mm -hmm. Hunt. Go meet up with Judy. Weaver, can you explain? Explain what? I mean, no promises, but I'll give it a go. Ooh. Have you seen Pam Am? Uh, no. Pam Am's missing, but I don't like the sounds of that. Hoping after I do this mission, we can go back and see the Pan Am stuff. Wait until evening? Sure. How far? Uh, I mean, I don't know. We're like, I think it's like 20% assimilated with him or something like that. You can see here if you hit I, a 15% the metamorphosis. Yeah. Judy. Hey V. Oh hi. Come on in. Pizza's getting cold. Thanks. Did you get me that weird avocado one? We're in the kitchen. You Johnny. You made it. Good. Grab a seat. This is Roxanne. She's Roxanne. worked at Clouds longer than any of us. Hello. You don't have to. Hey, nice to meet you. When I heard what you pulled at Clouds, shit, I so regretted I was off that day. Just eat the free pizza and then we're out of here, okay? Where you at, Johnny? Oh, there you are. How are you? Okay, I guess, but, you know, sad as hell. Hmm. So then, what's the plan? Need to wait for Michael. Uh, you mean the one that just came through the door right there? You'll never get rid of the stench of the corpse. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? So, what's this plan all about? I'd like to hear the answer to that too. I modified the behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier solo. Fascinating, isn't it? What one can learn while tuning fake orgasms for the moxes. Mind stepping outside? Can't Damn. smoke in here. You'll air it out later. Oh wow, you're a like top class. Fine, I'll sit by the window. There's a window in here? Well, there is. The body will react as if executing a well-trained series of movements. Already tested it out on Tom. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. So you teach everybody but how to use Kung Fu. the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. Gotcha. Tech that's all pros and no cons, I don't buy it. Side effects, spill them. Combat mode auto initiates when a threat is present, and uh, there's no way to stop it. Can't find a workaround. And that's it. I don't know. Only way to determine that would be through months of testing on a range of subjects. Can you like enter like a safe word? You could murder someone and not remember a thing. Hmm. All right. Got to see it to believe it. Finally, someone said it. Shut up. Tom? For starters, I relinquish all corporate representatives from the Ninth City Council. Pulled that sequence from a Kung Fu training virtue. This is straight up like uh, loading, pro what's it called, uh, combat training into the Matrix sort of thing. Oh, 
what I am. Gotta admit, not bad. Yeah, for the market square in Kabuki. Nah, before we start talking serious biz, gonna need to see serious action. <clears throat> you just saw him. I saw a bar trick. I want to see a fight. Got an expert in causing bodily harm among us. I want to see how Tommy handles him. Oh, you want him to fight me? Okay, I just got these new gorilla arms, so. I like it here. It's on now. Uh, you want to go? <laughs> oh shit! Ah. Oh. Ow. You there, can you hear me? <laughs> Look at me go! You see that? <laughs> Woo! Gotta do some cardio. Say. Just say it. Who? Me? This is my impressed face. Ah. V? Okay, okay. That probably sells it. The chip works. Let's get to it then. You've got an elite force of three muscle heads and a techie. What now? Guards and tiger claws in and around will overpower. Take down, disarm, escort them out. Clouds will be ours. Bosses, we'll give an ultimatum. A cut of the proceeds in exchange for never showing their faces at the club again. And having no say in how the club's managed. That's what I thought. A half-baked, insane plan. You can't see more than an inch ahead oh, of you. Oh, you're such a bitch. Taking out the security there won't solve anything. Claws will just send more. Hiromi Sato is the man you gotta get to. Where do we find Where him? Where do we find this Hiromi? At his apartment. H8 Mega Tower. Topmost floor. It's a penthouse. Almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us inside. Hmm. It's just my work. If we get him in his apartment, where he thinks he's completely safe, bosses will understand what we're looking to demonstrate. My, my. There's a flickering in that skull sponge of yours after all. Do we kill her? Do we actually so how about need her? B, Tom, Roxy? Made up your minds? I... I need to think about it. Never wasted anyone before, you know. I mean, you won't remember. All the way. V? Don't tell me you're seriously considering this. Sticking our precious necks out for a bunch of whores? Whoa, that's messed up, man. V, get it together. Count me in, Judy. Wait, don't talk shit. I was just weighing my I'd options. Help, didn't I? Thanks, V. Save the gratitude for later, please. Ugh. I'll set up the meet with Hiromi and let you know. He doesn't like days. that. Have fun. Toodaloo. Michael, hold up. Give us a lift. Only if you don't talk to me. Oh, I'm having a malfunction. Coming on. Oh, shit. I'm scared, V. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do will usually come to the price tag, I know. You want to help, I get that. But I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. Feels like it's only right. Out of the question. Judy, for real. No, don't want to hear it. But uh, be, be, not a word. Yeah. Put your mouth. Oh. No. Uh, uh, v, everything okay? Nope. V, you don't look so hot. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm better. Fine. What the hell, V? You, like, sick? Remember the heist Evelyn hired us for? The relic I was gonna clip. <sighs> Couldn't forget that in a million years. Well, in my head. That biochip. Well, long story short, it had Johnny Silverhand's mind on it. An engram of it that's overriding my mind. You being serious? Truly Badly. wish I wasn't. Fuck. Anything at all you can do? Trying to figure that I out. Hope. It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. 
Yeah, sure. Sounds great. I don't think he's in any condition Thanks. to go anywhere. Don't worry about it. Make yourself at home. Oh. Be there soon. Fuck me. It is awesome. <laughs> so I hear. Huh. Interesting. Place looks like a fucking antique museum. Then I guess you should feel right at home. Ah, Chicks got a taste. That all you have to say? And she's nice. Six out of ten. Oh, you actually sent me a picture. <laughs> Damn, that's a full on tank. Didn't know she dabbled in robotics. Now that's fucking Shimra. Think that's how she winds down? After a day's work of tuning hardcore smut? Wouldn't be surprised. Right? Well, well, well. The Bushido collection in BD format. First three are collector's items nowadays. Oh, she wrote a thing to Evie. Well, that's sweet. Hang on. Her clouds help, yeah. Someone likes getting their feet wet. Don't need to be an expert to tell the gears pro. Hey. Talk, make sure what you watch your tongue she rarely opens up to anyone outside the family. Yeah. Thanks. Who would have thought? Perilous future. Electro punk. I'd rather puke out my ears. Love great. Anything else you got to say about that? Back to enemies. Hello, V. Hi. Uh, Jefferson? Listen, I need your help again. Matters private. Sure. Okay. What's it I mean, about? Last time they paid me 11,000, no, no, so no. sure. Come by. I'll lay it out. Explain everything. Got your back, Jefferson. Not to worry. Great. We'll see you here then. Remember where? Yep. Of course. Be there in no time. Okay. Right. I need another break because I really need to pee a lot today, apparently. So I'll be back in a moment. I'm going to run another ad. I'm sorry. And we'll be going for like another two hours, so. Or hour, uh, hour and a half. But anyway, here we go.
Right, sorry about that. Made it as quick as possible. Beer, I am back. Let's go visit Pam Am. Um, we're getting a ride a tank, which is going to be hopefully awesome. Mm -mm. Well, hello there. Just a little more. All ready to go? Hey, V. No, not yet. Oh. Carol still needs to check if Militech left any ice in the system. Okay. Corpos haven't shown up in person to report the loss? No, I think we managed to keep them off our scent. We left the trucks with the big Corpo logos down by the Raffin camp. Oh, good. Which smart. Is almost smart. as much fun as leaving a bag of flaming dog shit on their doorstep. Fuck, made it look like it just came back from a Corpo war tour. Nice touch. Everything's fine. Clean as a whistle. And Saul, what about him? Nothing. For now. We're staying out of each other's hair. Okay. So he's not planning a family council? Of course he is. He just wants to keep me in the dark a while longer. Gotcha. I always wanted to take one of these suckers for a spin. Which is exactly how all those naive gonks landed at the front. Didn't even need to be recruited. They just showed you the tech. Come on, hop in. Everything is set. Oh. Oh my. Oh. Booty. <laughs> I was not expecting there to be a second passenger seat. All right, let's fire her up. Hold on to your head. Uh, do I need to do anything? Why well, I'm just here to look pretty. Damn it. Anybody get this thing up and running earlier? Maybe you Everything ought to- Everything is dandy. Give me a moment. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, yes! God, that's bright. Can someone turn off the lights? Hello? Please? It's not the latest model. <clears throat> but Mitch and Bob did what they could. Oh, my God. It's so... What do you think? Wait, this is a hover tank? Nice and cozy in here. You steer directly from your seat. All you have to do is jack in. What, no knobs, buttons, blinky doodads? No, nothing. The impulse runs directly to your cerebral cortex. In a sense, the basilisk becomes an extension of your body. Oh, great. It's like a mystical oneness. Oh, sure. Ever piloted anything like this? No, why? Don't you trust me? I mean... Can I still get out? Can I still get out? No. <laughs> then I trust you. If it's so mystical and shit, why the co-pilot? Extra support. I'll tell you once we're a bit further from camp. We'll practice. I'm guessing one's the pilot, one's the gunner. Oh, okay, I can actually see now. If you want full functionality in an engagement, you need a second person to handle sensory overload. Oh, okay. One pilot steers, the other handles the gun. That's what I just said. It's oddly pleasant. You'll see. Are we going to coexist mines? I've already got two pe uh, someone else up here. Okay, this will do fine. A dry run first. I'll disconnect for now. Okay. Doesn't need two pilots. You won't be steering and firing. Are you ready? Uh, sure. Oh, 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 oh. Man, am. Is this, uh, as designed? Neural synchronization doesn't happen at the snap of one's fingers. It'll be over soon. There. See? Oh. Oh, my, okay. Okay. Still 
understand what you meant. Warm up. Don't worry. I'm not gonna watch. Just put it through a few turns. Alright. I can see you've grown bored. Now take her along the line of turbines. When I say so, swerve right or left before the last of them. Alright. Engines online. Do it. I mean, that's not overly complicated, but cool. Right. There's room for improvement. I'm sorry. Okay, it's my first time. Now let's do some shooting. Stop and I'll activate the system. What's on the menu? Don't get excited. The Basilisk is a cargo ship by design. Okay. But it should still be a good time. All right, blast those wrecks. Okay, practice is over. Thanks. V, do you remember what I said about impulses? Mm-hmm. Well, wash out now. Oh. What's oh. happening? Hi, Jackson. Our nervous systems are now linked. Right. Basilisk pilots working in harmony. Oh. That's why I'm feeling everything doubled. It's sensory feedback. Our systems are intertwined. Would you like to try it out? Uh, sure. Oh. Okay. Uh, I could go for that. Oh. Oh, that Can you feel that? Um. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. Um, uh, no idea how people can focus in combat. It's probably not always this intense. How about this? That was not what I expected when we went to ride a tank, but sure. Uh, and we're also feeling what each other are feeling at the same time? What about sensory overload? Oh. Some trippy shit. This game, I swear. I want to have fun thinking this up. Fight! 